Right. I'm doing well. I'm really happy that the film will be shown tonight and I haven't seen it since Cannes premiere. So and I will happy to see it again. Amazing. And talk to me about how you got attached to the project. Um, Sean Becker found me and you know... The, you were living in Russia? Um, yes, but I, I'm living back and forth. Okay. So, and um, he found me, I think it's the world of mouse. And uh, I knew Karen Karugunan before and Yuri Borisov has told about me. And Sean has watched my film uh, by Kirill Michanowski it's called Give Me Liberty and Sean loved it so much so and it's a destiny it's a fate i think you know it's, yeah it's beautiful yeah. and talk to me a little bit about i know for um russian history it's been art has been such an important part of you know your russian history talk a little bit about what that's meant for you during this time in your country uh, during this time, yeah. you know, it's like a Russian story through the eyes of Russian simple woman. But it's interesting, you know. Um, I hope everything will be good. And I think this film is a very strong bridge between our cultures, our countries. And uh, for me, uh, there are no boundaries in culture, no boundaries in cinematography, in arts. And um, we don't have to build walls, we have to build bridges. You understand my English? I'm learning my English. It's, and it's perfect. It's perfect. I'm Thank very you so impressed. much. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so much. You were great in the film, by the way. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, I've had so much fun tonight. Thank you. No, it's okay. We can we can get we can get by without it. All right. He can squash down. Are you guys going to pose together? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Together. Okay. And Simon and Simon, just turn your shoulder toward me or so. That smile. Stay there. That smile. Last one here. And Simon, just back. Thanks, sir. Good job. And next to her. Yeah. And we'll get that. Oh, cool. Nice, guys. Right here for me. Cute. There we go. Cute. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Guys, guys, together. No. Nice turn your shoulder No, he was in uh, one of Sean's Oh, Guys, eyes right here. Simon, those eyes. Thank you, guys. I want to see how people will react because it's the first time when uh, you know it's not in the festival because uh, we did go back with that. At this time, I think it's another specific community because it's for everybody. We just got here, so yeah. Stay there one last time, that smile. But this is, you know, it's European and the national audience, and here it's American. 
Yeah. Just people from neighborhood. It's crazy. Yeah. It's Mikey. Mikey. I'm sorry. We promise we're going to do it all. All the things are going to happen. Well, just make sure you get Sean, because I, he's right there. He'll get in with them, but I, I think he's, I don't know if we're going to be able to get solos of him. Everybody right here, please. Yeah, guys. One time straight ahead, all our thank yous. And then Sean, jump in the middle of this photo. Jump in the middle of this. Hey, everybody. Yay, Sean. Hey. Yo. We like you. Hey, hey. How are you? Hey, how are you? Hey, hey. Yes, it's just a sweater. The suit's never working. You're right in the middle. You're right in the middle. One more. Oh, yes. One more. Yay. OK, yes. Great. Thank you. Thank you. Hey guys, straight ahead for me, thank you. Hold that. Good looking group. Thank you. Okay, straight ahead, please. Everybody, straight ahead. Looking, looking, everybody. And everybody right here, please. And up here, please. Two up here, please, everyone. Sean, straight ahead, sir. You're good. Sorry, sorry. We're good. We're good. Two up. Let's go. I'm on this side just so we're yeah. more in the back. Yeah. No, it's really yeah. the back. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay, guys, everybody straight ahead for me. Thank you. Straight ahead right here. Here we go. Thank you. Straight ahead, Sean. 
You know, how many, I'm sorry, how many can you ask? Everybody take one step to your right, just so we're all completely on the right. Right or left? Uh, this is my room. Hi, hello, Hi, how, how are you? you? How are you? Good Give us two seconds. You guys were great in the film. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I loved it. It's one of my favorites this year. Um, Thank you. Talk a little bit about working with Sean um, and how he is as a director. I mean, Sean has directed me, what, nine times probably. And uh, I am so lucky to, to watch him mature with every film and develop and he's he's he's, he's such a lovely guy he's he's a, he's a very kind very loving person and that that's how our sets are there's so much love there so it's very easy for actors to bring out whatever they got right yes he's really amazing and i can say he's a genius and the way he's um, working with actors and how he how much he open for suggestions and and allowing us to improvise you know also he's, he was very selective and picky he should know exactly what we're saying in russian in armenian all the lines and everything what you're saying here but but that was truly blessed to work with him. He's also a very demanding uh, director, don't get me wrong. He's like, like, you know, you gotta make a left turn here and you gotta come into the scene in in Armenian, then turn to, to right in Russian, then come out in English. On the same time, I want the train to be passing behind you. <laughs> Seems like That's no piece true. of cake, right? right. You guys are pros, you did it. Thank you Thank guys you. so Thank much. Have so a great much. night. Appreciate Thank you. How's this been for you? I'm sure, I mean, first of all, I just want to say I love the film, and you were just like, oh my god, kick ass. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, I'm sure this has been like a roller coaster for the fan and everything on. Yeah, it has, and now we're finally premiering the film in Los Angeles, which is where I'm from, and my whole family is here tonight, and my best friend, so it's really special. Um, and talk to you a little bit about, I know you guys did that, that screening for sex workers, that was so cool. How did how, you guys get the idea for that? Yeah, that was something I really wanted to do um, to bring this community that I've fallen in love with together to see the film. And the response was just so overwhelming. I still, when I think about it, I feel so much love. Yeah. And I'm sure that's moving because you want to make sure when you're telling a community story that you're getting it right. It's, it was the most important thing to me. Um, and so I was nervous going into the screening. But, you know, we had cons um, consulted with so many incredible women who have similar lived experience to my character. So I felt that we were inherently doing something right. But just the feedback that we got after was, I mean, I kind of, it's hard to put into words exactly how it makes me feel, but it was really special. And then to wrap up, I'm sure you've seen online everybody talking about the, like, the Once Upon a Time in Hollywood Manson family just, like, kicking ass lately. Oh. Is that, yeah, like there's everybody, they're talking about how you guys are all sort of doing your thing. Has that been kind of fun to see? Just obviously, you know, you guys were all really younger at the time, and yeah, I don't know. I mean, all of the actors, the young actors I got to work with were so amazing. So um, I love watching them do their thing, and uh, I, I, I've been following all of their work, so that's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> that's so cool. Thank you so much, Frankie. Congrats. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Talk to me a little bit about. Um, so I know you guys did that screening for sex workers. Um, that was so cool. Why was that something that you guys wanted to do, and, and how did it go? Oh, uh, yeah. I'm so happy this happened because uh, that's uh, well, that's the audience I care about the most. I mean, uh, if they feel that we've represented them in the right way and the respectful, responsible way, then that's that's that that's what it uh, that's what it's all about. And so um, we weren't present actually we were in New York but it was Mikey and Lindsay uh, hosting it and everybody had so much fun and the video is amazing the video of like everybody clapping with the, the heels the pleasers, the pleasers. Yeah. incredible incredible we're so happy and we're, we're looking to do one in New York as well. oh cool oh that's great yeah. and talk to me a little bit about I know you've talked about um, when you moved to Florida project um, kind of the the jump of like having to um, you know do a union project and the, the increased challenges of having so many people involved. I wondered if specifically with this film, uh, the intimacy coordinators, if that was an added like challenge and, and what was that? No, no. Um, okay. We're our own intimacy coordinators, actually. Um, yeah, we, we, for me, my philosophy on it or my stance on it is that it's in, by it's by a case by case basis, a film by film basis, and it's always should be offered to the actors, and if they want one, 
then yes, of course. But um, as producers, all three of us, our priority is you know safety and comfort of our actors on set. And I've directed many over my career, so I was actually very comfortable with it. It was just if Mikey and Mark were as well, and yes, they were. So that's how we did it. And then to wrap up, I know you know you've made just a, a lot of films in terms of like varying uh, levels of, of getting attention and, and budget and all of these things. Yeah. Um, is that something you're cognizant of? Like, this is obviously getting it's big in the conversation for like best picture. Is that something you think of? I know this is a no, weird. No, no, we don't. No, no. I would say that uh, we think of it for perhaps. Well, one, you guys want to answer that? Um, we make uh, movies because we we love them. We actually don't think about making them for Oscars or other reasons. We we make things that are in our heart that we we're passionate about, and whatever happens, happens. Yes. Yeah. I mean, the Palma d'Or was was the win for me, <laughs> and I'm and that means everything. Um, but I'm also so happy that we are in the conversation because of my cast and crew. I mean, if Mikey's getting the attention. Hopefully, Drew Daniels will be getting attention for his wonderful cinematography, and that's that's what I hope for. Yeah. Thank you guys so much. I love the movie, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Okay. Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Everyone working on this movie was so in love with the story. Everyone like, was excited to be there, and all of our actors and crew just like very well. Oh, yeah. I, 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 so, I, I feel that audiences are maybe recognizing that and feeling it. You did. I did. Um, like, even even after we keep tweaking we keep tweaking we rewatch the film we see something else we make a change it's like never it's never ending it almost feels like but it's because we want it to be perfect and we know it's forever and we care that much and even if maybe not everybody's going to notice these little tiny things i think filmmakers do and i think cinephiles do and that's what's important for us ultimately is like making them proud in a way or making them love our film and really uh, showing the care that i think these these projects really and so was that Something. I mean, how do those th two things fit together? So right, like Liam, you coming into your own career-wise. I don't usually do. Just do just fell into Big guy, get it right. You know what I'm saying? There we go. Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you. 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 It's crazy. Yeah. And what was it like working with him? Talk to me. He seems like very uh, hands-on, but also kind. <laughs> sure, he's very kind. Uh, but the, the most important, I think, uh, thing about Sean Baker, like a director, that he is uh, really humanist and he's full of love to every personality and to every, not just actor on the set, to everybody on the set. Because it's just, I don't know, it's his identity. He built from it. He built from love. Yes, and uh, it's uh, I, not secret, but it's his main feature. And because of it with the Sean, it's a big pleasure to be just beside the Sean. On the set, or maybe here on the, this carpet, uh, ev everywhere. Yes, because he is a huge person. Well, and that comes through in his movies, right? It would be a shame if he was like a jerk in real life, if he makes these really meaningful movies, you know? Yeah, I, 
Yes, what can I answer? <laughs> no, yeah. Just... Um, and talk to me a little bit about, as um, a Russian artist, um, what, you know, I know uh, art has been such an important part of, of your country's history. Can you talk about what it means to be an artist for you at this point in your country's history? What does it mean to be an artist? It's a big pleasure that you are saying artist and not the actor, because uh, in my uh, uh, university, Moscow Art Theatre School, I think it's a, just want to say, every time I want to say thank you for my university in Moscow Art Theatre School, because there every time they are trying to teach us how to be not just an actor but an artist. Yes, uh, and uh, I don't know, I'm already an artist or not, I think not, I'm on my way. Yes, but because uh, of working with that same with the directors like Sean, I am you know I am approached to be an artist already, and uh, yes, is it an answer or not? Yeah. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank you. I'll talk to you tomorrow. At yes. The Let's yes. Ah, there yes. in the yes. four seasons. Yes. yes. Boys, right here, all eyes right here for me. Thank you. One more. Here we go. Big smiles. <laughs> Gentlemen, hold that for me, please. Just right ahead. That smile. Smile. Gentlemen, right in front. <laughs> Everybody, right here, right here. That smile. <laughs> right in front of you guys. Right in front. Oh. Hey guys, right here, please. Thank you. Guys, <laughs> are Tell me one time, all four, one last time. Look at everybody looking. Thank you. We're going to grab Mark, we're going to do solos. We're going to start right here with AP. 
How are you? How are you? How are you? Um, good. Congratulations. You were so amazing in this. Um, talk to me a little bit about, I mean, you and Mikey have such this, like, consistent journey throughout the film, which is just probably an understatement, I guess. Um, talk about kind of how you guys navigated that, your relationship and the tension that you had to navigate. I don't know. Nobody knows. It's just a magic, you know. It, we just spend lots of time together and uh, try to feel everybody, feel Sean, our crew, and uh, I don't know how. <laughs> um, well, you guys did it great. Um, the magic was there. Talk to me a little bit about, you know, I know throughout the history of Russia, art has been such a big um, part of your guys' experience. Um, can you talk a little bit about what it's meant to you to be an artist during this time in, in your country's history? Uh, what, what do you mean? Uh, Just like given, the, the, you know, everything that's going on in your country, kind of how, what it means to be, and like what the role of art plays in all of that. You know what I mean? Uh, not, not, uh, you know, it's not so important, uh, m more important that, uh, I don't know, concretely people, it's not about nationalities and uh, it's about souls and uh, loneliness of these souls and uh, trying to uh, find someone for for feel each other and don't be lonely. Yes, like it's this. super crazy. Thank you so much. Congratulations.